After a season of trying that was marred by multiple occasions in concussion protocol, Tua Tagovailoa broke her silence with a social media message on Friday, leaving many fans bewildered as to what it meant. Of that tweet, Tagovailoa tweeted, when one chapter ends, another begins. Proud of this last one, excited for the next one, did a doctor tell Tagovailoa he couldn't play football anymore? Did he leave Miami? Or is the former Alabama standout simply talking about the 2023 season he hopes will be injury-free? It is really difficult to know the meaning of quarterback here. Unfortunately, Tua Tagovailoa has been in the headlines for the wrong reasons all year long. Two concussions in the span of a few weeks where he was barely able to walk straight after a couple of hard knocks forced the NFL to change their protocol. A third game in late December against the Green Bay Packers ended his season, without a doubt, concussion experts spoke to Tua about his future in the NFL. Suffering so many head injuries in such a short amount of time is worrisome for his long-term health. In the near future he will have to pass many NFL health tests if he passes it he will be able to play again, if he does not meet the health standards he will end his career here, sorry Tagovailoa. Despite being an MVP and one of the NFL's hottest stars, Lamar Jackson seems like a legitimate candidate to be traded this season. The Ravens may actually be on the verge of a divorce from quarterback Lamar Jackson. Jackson is still a Raven, but with the two sides still unable to reach an agreement to renew, it's time to speculate on which of the double-threatened quarterbacks will land next. Although Tua Tagovailoa has played very well this season and cemented his position, his concussion problems are what has the Miami Dolphins concerned about Tagovailoa's future. Instead of risking everything by signing a long-term contract with the former Alabama standout, Miami could use its draft capital, and possibly a young player or two, in exchange for Jackson, who would instantly turn the team into a top Super Bowl team. Head coach Mike McDaniel clearly knows how to bring out the best in his players. So it will be interesting to see how he maximizes the skills of a midfielder who prides himself on excellent physical strength and excellent arm strength. Meanwhile, Jackson's stardom will reach another level in Miami, bringing him into the spotlight like never before. Oh, and being assigned to dynamic duo Tyreek Hill and Jalen Waddell while being paid as a top player in his position will make the dream of moving to Miami come true for Lamar Jackson.